When I was a kid, there was one film that made a huge impression on me, and that was... That's right, it was Jurassic Park. So I thought today, we would relive my childhood passion together and learn how to say dinosaurs or names of dinosaurs in Chinese. First word of the day, dinosaur, kong long, or as George would say it in Peppa Pig, kong long. <laughs> kong long means terrible dragon or terrible lizard. What you'll find throughout this video is that the Chinese names are often direct translations of its Greek or Latin roots. They're actually, in my opinion, easier to understand and easier to say. Let's start with the dinosaur that used to give me the most nightmares, the king of the dinosaurs, Tyrannosaurus rex. As you can hear from the English, there's the word tyrant in it. And that's why in Chinese it's called bao long. Um, a tyrant in Chinese you could say is a bao jun. So that's the tyrant dragon, bao long. <laughs> Next, the most clever of dinosaurs, the velociraptors. <laughs> in Chinese, they're often mistranslated as xun meng long, as in the fast and ferocious dinosaurs, not dragons. Um, but their actual name is ling dao long, or more accurately, ling dao long shu. <laughs> Broken down, that means smart, robber, dinosaur. The Latin root of it is actually a swift robber. So the Chinese actually very accurately represents that Latin root. Ling Dao Long. And that's why he says, Clever girl. Next, the Triceratops. San Jiao Long. That's pretty obvious because it's the three pointed dinosaur. Next, the armored tank of dinosaurs, or the gentle giant, a vegetarian like me, the Stegosaurus, Jie Long, the sword dragon, and it accurately describes the things on his back. And next, one of the most iconic dinosaurs, and for me actually more iconic than the T-Rex from Jurassic Park, and that is the Bronchiosaurus. <laughs> I've always had more trouble with English dinosaur names. The Chinese ones are way more simple for me because anyway, dyslexic's my name. Dragon! Okay. The Brachiosaurus, like your brachial artery, and actually in Chinese it's wan long. This is your shou, wan. And it's because the dinosaur has very long arms. Can you guess what? Lei Long is the thunder lizard or the thunder dinosaur. And that is the Brontosaurus. You can imagine it creating thunderish sounds as it's walking around. Lei Long. Jake Gao Lao Shi also submitted his favorite dinosaur, which is Pachycephalosaurus. <laughs> In Chinese, it's called Ho To Long the thick-headed dinosaur. And finally, to finish with two non-dinosaurs, but very cool animals, the first one being the pterodactyl. Yi shou long, the winged, in Chinese, hands, but in Latin, fingers, yi shou long, and here we still keep the word for dragon, for dinosaur in Chinese, yi shou long. And finally, the Megalodon. <laughs> There's a film coming out and it's just a cool bit of Chinese to learn. In Chinese, the Megalodon is called Ju Ya Sha, the giant toothed shark. Although the films have actually been translated as Ju Chu Xia, both represent teeth. And I guess the second one sounds a bit more menacing rather than cute little teeth. So Ju Ya Sha. I hope you enjoyed learning the dinosaur names with me and I hope that this video proves to a certain extent that Chinese can actually be quite straightforward. As a kid growing up, 
The English names of the dinosaurs are always super difficult for me, but I always found that I could picture the dinosaur by learning the Chinese names. You can find a much more extensive list at skirter.com. And don't forget to support these videos by signing up for a free trial to Skritter. Life uh, finds a way. Konglong? Konglong? Okay. <laughs> 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 okay.